As a new mentor, you might come across experiences which you haven't experienced before. So some of the ones that um, I've encountered are a mentee doesn't turn up for a meeting. Um, that, was, that was really interesting. A mentee brought me some cookies for the, for the first meeting. A, ment a mentee asked me directly, can I come and work for you? So these are things that sort of knocked me a little bit, but they all ended well. The first one, I let her know in a very pleasant way that I'd set up my day around meeting her at a certain time, and for her not to show up really put, me, put my day um, out of whack, so to speak. So she turned up for the second meeting, and she's turned out to be one of the, it's been one of the best programs I've been involved in. The, uh, the cultural difference that we had with the cookies, or I had, was a real learning experience for me. I accepted the cookies. I wasn't sure whether I was doing the right thing, but I think I did in the end. And I let her know that she didn't need to bring me presents each time. Um, but it was a really wonderful experience to have. And then the third one where, where someone who was pretty bold asked me directly, can I come and work for you um, with, um, as an intern? Well, I didn't feel obligated to take them on. The bottom line was we didn't have a position available. So I told them that they were okay and we just moved on. So sometimes the learning that they get is in that example, not getting their way. And in other examples, it's around what's different in the workplace um, compared to what they might have experienced at university or, or their cultural backgrounds might be different in other countries compared to the work environment here.